to solve the special exponential equation, let's use a method similar to the mathematical induction. If we are given x to the power 5 equals 5, we can take the fifth root, so we get x equals the fifth root of 5. Next, if we are given x to the power of x to the power of 5 equals 5, then both sides raise the power of 5. So we get x to the power of x to the power of 5, and then to the power of 5 equals 5 to the power of 5. We can write the left side as x to the power of 5 times x to the power of 5 equals the right side, 5 to the power of 5. So we get x to the power of 5 and then to the power of x to the power of 5 equals 5 to the power of 5. At this point, let's pick up some basic facts. The function of t equals t to the power of t, t greater than 1, is an increasing function because the derivative of f t equals t to the power of t times ln t plus 1 greater than 0. So if we are given t to the power of t equals 5 to the power of 5, then t must be 5. Okay? So now we use this one to this equation. So we get x to the power 5 equals 5. So by 1, we get x equals the fifth root of 5. So we get the same solution, right? Now let's move to the next case. If we are given x to the power of x to the power of x to the power of 5, e equals 5. Again, raise both sides to the power of 5. So we get x to the power of x to the power of x to the power of 5. And then to the power of 5. e equals 5 to the power of 5. So we can write as x to the power of 5 times x to the power of x to the power of 5. e equals 5 to the power of 5. And we can write as x to the power of 5 and then to the power of x to the power of x to the power of 5 e equals 5 to the power of 5. Now by 1, if we plug in x equals the fifth root of 5, then the base x to the power of 5 equals 5, right? By 2, if we plug in x to the power of, uh, x equals the fifth to the power of 5, then the exponent x to the power of x to the power of 5 equals 5, right? That means what? So x equals the fifth root of 5 is a solution of equation 3. Okay? But as we do for the nodes, you can prove the left side function is actually an increasing function. So the solution is a unique solution. Okay, I'll say unique. Okay. Finally, we can consider the given equation. So case four, if we are given x to the power of 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 five, e equals five. Again, raise both sides to the power of five, we will get x to the power of 5 and then to the power of x to the power of x to the power of x to the power of 5 e equals 5 to the power of 5. Again, when x equals the fifth root of 5, the left side base equals the right side base by 1, right? By 3, the left side exponent equals the right side exponent 5. That means the fifth root of 5 is a solution of the equation 4.
Again, you can prove the left side is an increasing function. So this solution should be a unique solution to the given equation. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.